Hello, welcome. Let's look at the question 7 of WASI 2025 January February edition. Here's question uh, 7 of commerce. A total of 90 students selected from some schools for science and math quiz were asked to indicate the meal they prefer, and that is banku, rice, and fufu. The results show that. 63 like banku, 55 like rice, and 50 like banku. 13 like banku only. 8 rice only, and 5 fufu only. And 22 like all the three meals. We are drawing a Venn diagram to illustrate this information. Find the number of students who like banku and rice, only two of the meals, and none of the three meals. So, we know when you see three set problems, we need to write a preamble, bringing out the information in terms of set. So let's bring out what the information will be. We will solve from here and come back to this side. So this becomes the first part. Now we can say that, given that, what are information given? Number of you, universal set, is given as 90. They are 90 student that were sampled, right? Then let's come to those who like Banku. So the number of B is 63. Number of R, which is rice, is 55. Number of Fufu is what? 50. Ending at this place. Then 13 like Banku only, meaning the number of Banku intersection Rice complement intersection fufu complement is 13. That is the only aspect there. Five fufu only. So that means let me pick it here. Number of banku intersection rice complement or complement intersection fufu. Is it fufu? Five fufu only. So we have okay, let's begin here. 13 banku, then eight. Rice only. So this, the complement will be here. Let's have the eight. Then banku, intersection rice, intersection fufu. What do we have? Five for fufu only. So only fufu meaning rice complement and banku complement. That gave us five. From there, 22 like all the three. So number of banku, Intersection rice, intersection fufu, all is going to give us what? 22. Now, since we're not told all students at least like any of the games, it means that we can be asked to find none of the games. So that's a complement. So number of B, intersection R, intersection F. Okay, that should be union, rather. Union this. Union these all complement. If you put them together, their complement is unknown. So let's say we have a variable in there. So now that we have all the information given out, it means we can even discard the question. Forget about what the question is about. All these can be input into our diagram called the Venn diagram. So let's look at the A part. We have to indicate that in our Venn diagram. Okay, so this is the Venn diagram with the three set intersection. The first circle for Banku, second for Rice, and the third for the Fufu. Now, we have already indicated the first line. In this case, we are looking for only Banku, and the number is 13. So this area is 13, only Rice, and that is going to be 8, only uh, Okay, only Fufu is also 5. Then the intersection of the 3 is given as 22. Then their union complement is also given as what? Y. So these are the information provided in the question. The empty spaces are showing areas we must find. So I am going to label here as A, B, C. So we need to find the values that can be used to replace that. Remember, the 63 here is comprising of this region, B, 
this region and this region. Four regions. One, two, three, four. All sum up to give you 63. Same as this, this, this. Give you 55. One, two, three, four, 50. So let's add all of them and see how we can do that. So what do we do from here? Let's say for the set biology, uh, as a biology, Banku, we are going to have 13 plus 22 plus A plus B to give you 63. We know A plus B is unknown, so let's have A plus B equals to, this is going to be 35. So 63 minus 35, right? So A plus B will be giving us, we should be having 28. Both A and B is unknown, so that becomes equation 1. Let's go for the number of rise, not only, just number of rise. That means that 8 plus 22 plus A, then plus C, that will also give me a total of 55. We know A plus C is unknown, so let's have 55 minus this year will be 30. So right here, we can subtract 55 and 30. So our A plus C should be giving us 25, which is also equation 2. We are dealt with this and this. So let's come to the number of Fufu. So for number of Fufu, the 22, remember 1, 2, 3, 4. So plus 5 plus B plus C equals to 50. Let's maintain the B plus C and have the 50 minus, this right here should be 27. Therefore, B plus C should give you 23. Equation 3. What do we do? We can see in equation 1, we have A. In equation 2, A. B, B, C, C. So we solve it simultaneously. So let's begin with solving equation, let's say, first and two. So equation one, what do I do? Let me subtract equation one minus equation two. Since I'm seeing A, A, if I subtract, that will be zero. I should be left with B minus C, right? B minus C equals to 28 minus 25 that should be giving us 3 that should give us equation 4 so now equation 4 and equation 3 have the same variable b b c c so i can solve them together solving let's say equation 3 minus what no let's add since i have negative here positive here equation 4 so B plus B, that should give me 2B. C plus minus C, that should be 0. 23 plus 3 should give me 26. But I'm looking for B. So let's jump the method and divide right here by 2. So B will give us what? 13. Knowing B means that we can find the B, the A, and the C. I'll only come back to either equation 3 or equation 4 since b is here i can also come to equation 1 to find a so i only say let's say put b equals to 13 into equation 1 so let's go to equation 1 here that means a plus b 13 equals to 28 so a will give us 28 minus uh, 13 that should be 15 you can cross check that should be 15 knowing a i can also find it from here so put a equals to 15 into equation let's go for equation 2 equation 2 says that a is 15 plus c equals to 22, right? 25. So C will just be 
25 minus 15. Let me just put it right here since I'm looking for that value. So we know the A, B, and what? C. Uh, this diagram is part of the first one, but since we are solving it, I am going to redraw the diagram again, replacing the values I had. So A, we had 15. So we put the 15 here. B, we had, uh, what was that, 13. And C, we had 10 as the drawing of four, the diagram once again. So that if you add one, two, three, four, you get your 65, 63, right? If you add all of these, 55 and 50. Okay, let's see what the question is asking for now. The first part is to draw a Venn diagram to illustrate. That was the diagram we drew. The part we draw where the A, B, C is there. That answered the first part of the question. Then the second part of the question is asking for find the number of students who like Banku and Rice. Where is Banku and Rice? This region. The Banku and Rice is the region for 15 and 22. So we just add that together and get the answer. So let's clean this space. So here we are looking for B, I, Banku, and Rice. So Banku and Rice is going to be this plus this. 15 plus what? 22. And that will give us 37. So it means 37 students like uh, Banku and what? Rice. Then let's go to II. The II is also asking for only two of the meal. We know this place is only one. Only one. That is only Banku, only rice, only fufu. This area is for both. Both Banku and rice only. They are not interested. You see, this region is for all of them. So if I come here, I am talking about all of them. But if I'm here, I am talking about only two. They said, well, only two of the games. Of the meal so 15 like banku and rice only banku and rice no need to enter into the fufu 10 for rice and what fufu only then is it the two meaning there are two meals rice and fufu only then here is what banku and fufu only 13 so we add the three regions and get our value so here we have only two of the meal so we only say that only two of the meals is going to be 15 plus 13 plus 10. That would be 30, 38, right? So we are looking for none. None of the meals. None of the meals simply means that we are looking for Y. This region. If we add everything in here, it's supposed to be equals to what? 90. So we just have to subtract the union of this from 90 to get a complement here. So let's see how that will be done. So remember, if we add everything in here, it gives us 90. The same way, if I add everything here, I get 63. So I'm taking all of these to represent what? 63 plus this, plus this, plus this, plus the Y, which is representing the sentence we are having here. So I'll not be featuring the sentence here. All of this equals to 90, meaning that 90 minus the addition give me Y, which is this. So I only have 90 minus the addition of 63 plus 8 plus 10, plus 5, also be giving you what? The 90. So we close this bracket here and see what that will give us. That will also imply that 90 minus, uh, let's see, 63, 71. So we have 86. And that gives us what? For student. Number of students who like none of the meal will be 4 representing the y here so we, if you add four here plus everything you should be getting 90. 
what I mean is that not this plus this plus this plus four, but rather the values in the three sets plus the complement will give you 90. I know the video is a bit lengthy, but take your time, watch it step by step and get all the, the tips that you need in order to understand questions of this nature. Like, share, comment, and subscribe.